You're listening to the Wholehearted Podcast, and I'm your host, Cohen Tan. So from what I'm hearing from you is, you sound like you you were a bit of a misfit in the workplace the last time, but um, as a misfit, you seem to embrace it, right? You don't, you, you don't seem to think of it as a problem, but it's something that you embrace. Was it always so easy to embrace, or were there any time in your life when you felt like, why can't I be more normal? more normal and why can't I be you know a little bit more like other people have you ever felt like that or no not at all uh, I don't know if I've really put myself into that kind of a thought um, uh, because I've uh, I would say I've kind of been a bit of a rebel that way in terms of trying to be on the other side but yes I've questioned the thoughts like uh, at least faced questions uh, from family from friends uh, uh asking me like oh, why do you have to do this you know uh, uh, why do you uh, don't you think it's a little too crazy uh, <laughs> trying out like this um, I remember when I was like uh, I was like in a very good position I was leading uh, I was like the head of a leading radio station the largest uh, broadcasting company and then I said you know what I'm going to quit to try something like people thought I was like kind of nuts because I kind of uh, the the station and all that had gone through the teething trouble and it was all set and it was all rolling. So people uh, like people felt like, hey, now it's like the smooth period. Why do you want to leave and do something? But then I realized um, uh, I love that uh, chaos and I like to crack that chaos and bring the stability. But then uh, the stability is for others to uh, take it and go because I feel uh, I thrive on the madness and chaos that is there so for me it is like i'm constantly looking for something different so that i get to go there crack it get it streamlined optimized and then get it rolling to the team to take over because i realized uh, i'm not the uh, person who would uh, sit and just keep doing the same thing over and over again because i think uh, repetition or um, something which is very repetitive brings in fatigue into me but having said this uh, though i would say you know you take this it's a painful process uh, <laughs> because uh, it's not <laughs> every day it works it's not that every day you get to do this so the rest of the day when you don't get to do it uh, rest of the day when uh, people question you for being odd time and again answering that sometimes becomes uh, painful you know uh, mm. uh, uh, early part of my life I used to try and justify it a lot you know uh, reason it out why I'm like this but I think um, with time and age I think what you matured to realize you said hey you know what you try and get into your zen mode and say hey you know what this is what I am and this is what I tell you and this is how I value add <laughs> thanks for being part of this heartwarming conversation today to the next episode stay wholehearted